The devil's devil has a couple food My culture's screwed cause this word is misconstrued Small countries exempt from food cause leaders have different views You choose What mean the world to me is being free Live and let live and just let it be Let it be Love, peace and harmony, one universal family One God, one aim and one destiny oh, yeah. Imagine life without a choice at all Giving a vote without a voice at all These be the problems that we face I'm talking poverty and race But no matter what the case we gotta in LA is heavy. There's a lot of it. Do it again. And I'll see you tomorrow. I don't know, like I get home from work and all I do all day is make shitty designs for bands and whatever. And so I come home and I just want to do my own thing that I care about for me that doesn't need to, doesn't need to be for anyone else. Get your adrenaline running. Stay out till 4 a.m., 5 a.m., 6 a.m. Then go back into work at 8.30 the next morning and be really tired. I chose the Andy Warhol image because he is an inspiration to everybody, I guess. You know, he just kind of did, he broke the boundaries of everything. And I don't know, like I, basically I'm paying like a tribute to him. It's like saying a thank you. It's like, thank you, Andy Warhol. Close calls. Um, I was on a building in LA and I was putting up about a nine foot Andy Warhol. And uh, one of my buddies that I was out with that night was on the street and I just hear him yell, cops. They, they basically rolled up on the front of the building. I, I head out the back, just jumped off the building, landed in a dumpster, and ran down the alley. Met my friend in my car, we took off. The cop goes to turn around in the back alley to find me. Sees my car, sees me get in a car, but then a random other car pulls in front of him, and it was like an alley, so he couldn't, he couldn't get around the car, and I took off the other way and like, kind of just lost him, but it was only because of that other car, and the other car just had no idea that they saved my life. <laughs> My work has no idea that what I do. Yeah, they probably they probably think I went out and partied the night before. You know, some people go out and get wasted at a bar at night and that's their hobby. I like to think that my hobby's a little more fun. There's watermelon jack. My name's Alec, aka Mr. Monopoly, 
aka the little ninja climber. I'm finding my way up if I want to get up there. I've been a full-time street artist for about two years now and uh, you know I grew up painting my whole life. My mom's a painter, my grandmother's a painter so you know the academic side I learned from an early age. I didn't really start doing street art until like two years ago when I discovered Wheat Paste and, and learned about the whole poster game and Wheat Pasting and stencils, stuff like that. That's what really got me into the street art side of it. Wheat Paste is flour, water, and wood glue if you want to get a little funky with it. And you always got to add the sugar. The sugar gives it that little tacky, nice stick. Throw that on the stove. Start out with the flour. You gotta have your measuring cup. What I use right here. The highly anticipated return, illiteracy. This is no placebo. The follow up to us checking your ego. A lot of personas have been exposed as made up, like those in the culture known as emo. <laughs> Welcome. This is where the uh, magic happens. This is um, this is actually the original drawing I did for the Jack pieces I do that many of you seen out there. They all start out that way and then they turn out on your block or your corner, on your local store. This is uh, Twiggy actually. I just started her so she'll be a painting pretty soon. This was actually one of my favorite hats before I turned it into this weird little light. I'm still tempted to put it on, you know, it's kind of similar to this hat. But, you know. You know, I obviously paint because it's something I love to do. I, I mean, I'm going to paint for the rest of my life whether you guys like it or not. And, I mean, my whole message is I'm just trying to bring art into people's lives that normally would never pay attention to it. You know, I'm doing what I love and that's to paint and bring art into everyone's lives. I'm just doing my thing. This is Alec Monopoly, shout out to Vimeo.